Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Hunt Noobs. And real quick, I want to thank you guys for checking out my video for today. There's a lot of information going on right now. Twitter is somewhat blowing up and it's amazing to be completely honest with you, man. There's a lot of information that I want to get to you guys. So sit back, relax. I want to talk to you guys. And also I want to get your input. So obviously I want that comment section to be blowing up with your thoughts. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and jump on into it, guys. So Charlie Intel has been posting a ton of stuff. Now, if you guys aren't familiar with Charlie Intel, uh, they are pretty much somewhat of the insiders when it comes to Call of Duty. Uh, at least a lot of information that we get and a lot of stuff that is leaked. Uh, it was it is pretty much through those guys. And there's a few other people out there. Obviously, David Vondahar, he does his own thing. But some of the information that, that does happen to be leaked is um, you know put out through these guys. And I would like to think the most interesting thing that was put out uh today that i just read is that people that pre-order black ops 3 will have access to a beta now this is fucking huge news guys uh we've been asking this for a long time and a matter of fact i've spoken to david von Hart a couple of times about this why don't they put out a beta um he didn't really touch on to it but uh you know he didn't really allude from it or you know go in depth on but i'm glad to see this this is really great news because you know, in my opinion, if you believe in your product and you think what you guys are putting out is good shit, then obviously you don't mind putting out a beta, letting the people kind of critique it to an extent and be able to take some constructive criticism on how the game is going to be played. Now, with this being something new to uh, Treyarch, with this, uh, we don't know if it's going to be advanced movement, boost jumping. We all don't know quite yet what it's going to be. But it's going to be new to them. So, in my opinion, they want to get it right. Now, this is something Advanced Warfare should have done. Um, obviously, they, they were thinking outside the box, and maybe they wanted it to be a big surprise. But when you tried to go in the direction they did and kind of, in my opinion, messed it up, or you, the cameras can't even really keep up with the player, um, if they would have did a, a, did a bait or something like that, maybe they could have fixed this beforehand and fixed a few other the flaws, a lot of the flaws that they had. But they could have fixed some of the stuff. So, uh, kudos to uh, Treyarch. Uh, for you guys doing something like this because this is a brilliant idea man um, also some really kick-ass news that I came across is that um, typically when black ops excuse me not black ops but when call of duty is released um, it's always been launched on a midnight release on a Monday slash Tuesday right Monday midnight slash Tuesday uh, early morning um, now it's been going on like this for years to be completely honest with you guys I never was a fan of it I'm sure a lot of the people that are watching this feel the same way because for the most part people had to either go to school or work in the morning now i've worked at night but uh still it messed up my day nonetheless because i would be up all day playing the game and then going to work tired and of course you tell yourself while you're at school or while you're at work hey when i get home i'll rest when we know that's not the case when you get back home you are balls deep back into the call of duty action again and at least till the honeymoon phase is over with but you know you're back at it so your your first couple of days are pretty screwed so the rumor mill has it well i don't even think it's a rumor anymore because the posters have provided this information as well the leak posters I, I haven't really touched on that as well like i said there's a lot of information um has indicated that the game will be coming out november the 6th which is a friday how lay lou yeah and i know it said how lay lou that's country as i can get and that's as country as i am but it's amazing guys now if this is the case and everything uh, proves to be true this is ideal, man. This is what the hell we want. We wanted a beta. We want uh, the game to be released on a weekend. Now, some people are like, well, it's a few days later than what it is. Who gives a shit, man? I don't mind. It's great because I don't have to worry about going into work, fucking tired of shit, or you guys don't have to worry about going into school, whatever the case may be. Um, it, it makes sense, and I've always wondered. I wish it could have been the weekend before, you dig? Also, there's some rumors who reason why they're doing this as well is that Sony and Nintendo have big exclusives being dropped that week as well, or right around right the same time, which Battlefront, and I'm not quite for sure what Nintendo has been, uh, what they're dropping. Um, I had maybe guess Splatoon or something along those lines. Uh, one of the uh, exclusives, major exclusive that Nintendo is providing. So it's a smart move on Treyarch's part because, you know, it's, it goes with like artists, man. You never want to drop your album at the same time somebody big as you are is dropping their album. It just doesn't work out well. You want to, you know, you want you want the hype train to be all you. You don't want to be lost in the hype train, right? So kudos again to uh, Treyarch for doing this, man. I mean, this is what we expect from Treyarch. This is why I love this development team. Um, you know, for the most part, people can beg to differ about whether they care or give two fucks about us. I think Treyarch does, man. They they think like us, man. And that's one thing I've always said about Vondahar. 
He is a gamer. I've gamed with him for many months, man, for a, for a while now. And the part that I really respect about him is he is a gamer at heart. And these types of moves, in my opinion, showcase that Treyarch and their mindset is for the gamers. So, again, kudos to you guys. We love that you're doing this. Write in the comments section below, guys. Let me know what you think. Do you like the fact that they're going to have beta codes? Also, uh, what I read as well, as it's only going to be uh, the beta code is going to be for the uh, quotation fingers next gen consoles, which is the PS4, the Xbox One, and PC. So, you know, it's, they haven't really determined whether the 360 or the Wii U and the PS3 is going to be cut out of this or not, the beta or the game alone. Um, you know, that still remains to be seen. But I don't know. For me, regardless of the fact is, you know, I do, I am lucky enough to have an Xbox One and a PS4, so I'm going to be definitely playing it. And if I want to, I probably get down on my PC. My PC is pretty strong as well. Um, so I'm going to be able to get the hold of the beta. I'm going to be able to play it, and I can't wait for it just to get an idea of what's going on. And um, you know, hey Treyarch, man, they they do wonders, and I'm excited for them. So again, write in the comments section below. Uh, let me know what you guys think about the beta code. Let me know what you think about it possibly next gen only. And also let me know what you guys think about the release date being changed as well. Again, just a lot of information. I'm sure there's going to be a lot more information to come. Um, I'm sure your sub box is going to be fucked up in a matter of a couple hours. But, you know, hey, it is what it is. I'm talking to my people. Obviously, people that's in the flood, uh, the, the, the sub box is going to be talking to their people. And if you're part of both parties, hey, so be it. I hope you guys appreciate this information I brought to you guys. If you did, please feel free to rate the video with a like. If you dislike it, please feel free to rate the video with a dislike. With that being said, it's your boy Hunt Noobs. I'm out this bitch. Deuces. Get wrapped, son. Woo! And that's what the fuck I'm talking about, Triarch. Do your thing, goddammit.